Hello everyone, this is just a little tutorial I'm going to show you how to put these little flowers on. They're very simple, it's just a single a single stitch. There's different ways of doing things like this, there's chain stitch, but this is just a single stitch. So I'm going to show you, I just have a needle here. And I've cut some lengths of wool for the, um, I'm going to put three flowers on, the same as what's on here, that one, that one, and one down there on the other side. So I've cut off three strips of blue for the flower and three strips of the green for the leaves. So I'm going to start with the blue. And you just thread the needle and I'll blow this up so you can see better. And I'm going to put the first one. I put this one here. One, two, three stitches in from the, um, the border here. And it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten stitches down. So I'm going to count one, two, three. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That looks a bit lower. I don't think I've got that. I don't think I went down that far. I'll have to count those up again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's more like it. And then it's three stitches in, so that's one, two, three. So I'm going to come in through that stitch there from the other side. I'm just coming in there, leaving a length on the other side like that. And then I'm going to start. You're going into the very centre of the V of the stitch when you do this. But you can just go anywhere you want on the, um, the other one. So I'm going in there, just bringing it out. Coming back through that same stitch there. Going a little bit further up. I do about six of these stitches. So it looks a bit like a, a little flower. There, and then you just go to the back of your work and just take the, the wool out. And I'll put that back on the needle. I've joined it in first. You take it into the back of the work and just take the back to where one of your stitches are and just take the needle through and loop it through just to tighten it up a little bit take the needle out and then just wrap your your wool around a couple of times to knot it that's one knot and then another knot on top and that's all you need to do your scissors and just cut that off so that's the blue part done and then we're going to do the green and exactly the same you're going to come up through the same stitch that you did the, uh, all the blue ones in and get it in right into it 
I'm having a little bit of trouble with this needle. I think I've knotted too close to the hole. <laughs> That's it. And yeah, so you leave a length behind there to tie it off. And then you're going to go one stitch. Back through that hole again. And then do a little bit longer stitch. Back through that hole again, the same hole. Up on the other side, a short stitch. Back through. And then you want a longer stitch there. And then you just go back on the other side and you just knot it on the other side and then go twice through the Pull it tight, once again, oh, stop the scissors, and that's one flower made there, and now I'm going to make another one a bit further up. Have another blue strand. And I'm going to go about one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five stitches there. And it was about three, one, two, three, four down, one, two, three, four. That's about the right place. I think that's a bit close. I'll go on that one there. So I've come in there, leave a, a length on the other side for tying off. Your first back through the same hole where you started it, go further up, make a longer, longer petal this time. Back through that same hole again. Bit higher up. I think that's enough on there. Now we just take it to the back. A 
just loop it once around and then just tie off. That's a flower. Now we'll do the leaf again. And so I'm going to come up through that same hole that I put the other ones in. Leave a length on the other side for the fasten it off afterwards. And you go back through there again. Back through that same hole again. The other side. Back through that hole again. And make a longer bit of a leaf this time. And then just take it through to the other side. Loop your, your needle around and come through the loop. That tightens it off a little bit. And then it's just tying it off. Wrap it once, twice around. And then once again, and then cut it off. That's two little flowers there on both sides. And now we'll do another one at the bottom here. So I want another blue. If you want to make a stalk like you can bring your your green down a couple of stitches a bit further down down there if you want to make a little stalk on the um the flower but I'm just making them little buds. And there we have some little flowers on the just a simple little thing just to set off the um the cardigan. Give it a little bit to take the, the bareness off the cardigan. So I hope that was helpful to anyone. So thumbs up and subscribe and I'll catch you all another time. So bye for now.